Good morning, everyone. So it is just before 6 a.m. We have a day full of adventures today, and we're going to take you guys along the whole way. We had to meet the bus at 6 a.m. since Banyos is a three-hour drive south of Quito. Luckily, we made a few stops along the way. store to pick up some snacks. We're gonna grab some coffee, a little breakfast in the restaurant next door. So the breakfast includes one coffee, one juice, we got an extra coffee, and then it's a queso cheese sandwich and eggs the way that you want it, we decided to get them fried. We stopped in Salcedo, a town famous for their ice cream, and got their traditional mixed flavor, and it was delicious. waterfall in Baño. This place is huge. So we're at our second stop and we're going to cross the canyon in a cable car. above a river that is the beginning of the Amazon River. Really cool experience. So now we're headed to the Devil's Cauldron. So we're at the trail to the Devil's Cauldron. We took the choice of going over the shorter trail there's a 35 minute option and then like a 15 minute option that has some suspension bridges. So we figured the suspension bridges would be pretty cool and we're gonna check those out. I don't even know if you can hear me right now. It's so loud with the waterfall and we're not even that close. So cool. This waterfall is 
gorgeous and it is just roaring. Walking up is way harder than walking down. That was cool though. Last stretch of the Devil's Cauldron hike. Headed back to the van and off to the next adventure. It's definitely a lot more crowded now than it was when we first got here. And that's only what, 45 minutes? Get here early. We're at Casa de Arbol. It is a tree house that overlooks Banos. There might even be a swing. So our tour guide is in line for us. He's letting us just kind of explore this little park area. And we're gonna go back in about 20 minutes and then do the swing over the edge of the world, which is really epic. That was wild guys. I am a huge scaredy cat when it comes to heights as I'm sure you guys know by now. And that was high. That was real high. What'd you think? That was awesome. It was very, it's definitely a little jolting. Um, but something you should, you should do if you guys come here. It's awesome. Highly recommend guys. Check it out. We just finished up at Casa de Arbol. Now we're gonna go check out Banos. It was at this point that our adventure took a turn. Shannon ended up feeling very sick and we spent the next hour and a half in the car resting while our tour mates explored Banos. We got lucky and saw a rainbow when we left for our three hour drive back to Quito. We even got to see some fireworks for Carnival. So we made it back to the house. It's probably around eight o'clock right now. So it's been a pretty long day considering we woke up at 4.30, but everything was great. Shannon's feeling a lot better and we're just gonna get some dinner and crash. Thanks for coming along guys.